Hey, what's up, people? It's your man, Pastor Eddie L. Young, Restore Glory Christians in the Monticello, Florida. I'm going to take you for a quick trip around our church van. Many of you have seen it before. You know, we had it uh, redone a couple of months ago uh, through Lightning Graphics. Thank you, Jeff Clark, for hooking us up with a cool design, new design. Uh, and when we first got it, we got it designed one way, but I went to Jeff, I said, Jeff, I want another design. I want a different design, something new, something different. And again, so we got a second design on it. And so when I begin to think about, you know, this church van, I begin to think about all the cars and cars that are manufactured off the assembly line, how, you know, you can be driving, you can see a car that looks just like your car. Same color, same model, same everything, same rims, the whole nine, because, you know, manufacturers, build them off the assembly line to look the same and yet when i thought about that i thought about you how god uniquely made you how god made you so special and different that the bible says the gifts and talents or gifts and callings of god are without repentance god's not sorry the way he made you he made you different he made you unique he made you a one of a kind to change and even challenge the world to impact the world to represent and represent him hey god's not sorry the way he made you god's not sorry for the gifts and talents and calling that he gave you so why should you be apologetic about who you are why should you be apologetic about uh, not following the crowd or being unique or being set apart or being handpicked god created you special to do something special so beloved god be unique be you Use the gifts, the talents, the calling. Use everything that God got inside of you. Don't follow the crowd. Hey, blaze the trail. Because eventually, i tell you this, the world needs what you have inside of you. The world needs your uniqueness. The world needs you because, again, you bring something special from heaven that heaven needs to put in this earth. So, beloved God, don't be afraid to be who you are. Be who God created you to be and the world will be blessed because of who you are. This is your man, Pastor Eddie L. Young. I'm out of time, but I am not out of word. I want to remind you everywhere we go, let everybody know that the word of God will restore your glory.